Hi, and welcome back everybody. Thank you. Thank you so much. So in today's episode of What's the Point, we're going to focus on animals and animals in specific ecosystems. Now, one animal in particular, no, not you, Mika, but this one animal is a keystone species for this particular environment. That's right, I said it. Being a keystone species means that if this animal was to disappear, the environment that it surrounds would greatly be affected. Let's take a look. The keystone species I'm talking about are oysters. Oysters are actually environmental engineers. Kind of like the engineers that we have, they help build a foundation and maintain it. Take a look at these construction workers. Notice that in order to make a stable foundation, they have to use tools such as shovels to spread around the dirt. Oysters also maintain a stable foundation, but unlike the sweaty workers, they use minimal energy in doing so. Being a foundation species means that oysters act as a substrate for other animals such as barnacles, mussels, and tunicate species. By resting in the lower tidal areas of the estuaries, oysters are also the third line of defense against erosion. Erosion is the act of having nutrient-rich sand and dirt from the shoreline fall back into the water. If oysters were removed from the estuary, not only would erosion occur, but small fish and crab would not be able to use the oyster clusters as a hiding place anymore from large predators. As you can see, oysters are key to the environment, hence why they're known as a keystone species. Without them, the estuary wouldn't know what to do with itself. Thanks for joining us. That's all the time we have for today. Join us next time on What's the Point? Goodbye.